Um, Uru doesn't care that much about toilet paper, luckily. Okay, okay. Chat, need confirmations, because it's hard to tell while I'm in VR. Sound good? Recording good? Volume good? Everything good, chat? We good to move? Back now with coffee, Poggers. So she, she is a good girl, honestly. All good. All right, I trust in you, Nazar. All systems are go for launch. Thank you, Lars. Let's go, dude. I think shit's about to get reeled. Didn't we? No, we didn't come from here. Um, oh, oh no! There's no cockroach in there, man. Someone, someone, go Google what these cockroach things in Half Life are called, so I can actually give them their proper name. Because I don't remember, honestly. Oh, come on. It was right on the end piece. What was I going to do? Welcome back, Kaya. Hope you're feeling fresh. Head crabs. It's definitely not a head crab. It's a snark. Dude, I feel like I need to shower after every single hour of playing friggin' Half-Life on VR, to be honest. Oh. <laughs> God damn it, man! Get it back in there. Oh yeah, hold on, where's the thing? Gotta dodge these bad boys. No messing up this time. Gonna break my wrist doing this shit, man. Nice. How you see chat in VR? Uh, I got a plug-in. Oh, nice. These guys, I'm wondering what they're called. So these used to, there used to be a weapon in Half-Life 2 or 1 where you could fire these guys out and they would jump on people. And she goes. Uh, it's giving you feedback when you grab something. Uh, yes. There's a vib. There's a vibration. It's vibration every time I'm hit with one of these goddamn needles. <laughs> okay, they're snarks. Got the snarks. Thanks, Lucas. Into the backpack. Looking good. All healthed up. Very, very nice. I still don't get how injecting an alien fetus into... That's no fetus, dude. That's a fully grown uh, snark right there. Right. Show some respect. Here it is. Now, just snip those cables and off we go. Uh, just snip the cables. Uh... I don't see any way to disconnect the cables in here. That doesn't sound good. This isn't gonna be as easy as it from the ground. Wow. I gotta do every single one of those? Surely not. Okay, let's just push this random lever. You guys down with that? Yes! This is a two-handed job right here, man. Alright, hold on. One. Oh. What the heck is going on? Uh, that does not seem to be doing anything. Let's try number five over here. Number four. Number three. Um. Interesting. Anything else around here? Or is this the whole puzzle? Let's just have a quick look around. Make sure we're not missing something. Oh, hold on. Maybe I gotta get my magic wand out. Uh, 
Um, yeah, I'm assuming you gotta do it in the correct order. You shoot everything to solve your problems. I mean, I tried shooting myself yesterday, that didn't work. More bullets wasted. Problems not solved. Okay, order. Um, what's this? None of that. No, 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 no. What do these mean? I don't know. That one's green. Does that mean anything? It's green. Okay. No. Russ, I can't figure out how to disconnect these cables. Maybe try opening the cable shielding and shooting them. Ah, got it. Oh, guns do solve the problems. Oh my god, okay. Hey! That's how we do it. Oh, this doesn't seem good, guys. Let's keep doing it. Look up more. Yeah, so there's a thing with VR um, that is very annoying for the viewer, and that is when I look up, okay, I use my eyeballs because it's natural. It feels normal. But that's not giving you guys the view, so I need to, like, really break my neck to give you guys the correct view. Like, I'm assuming the vault is in, like, the middle of the screen right now, right? But I, like, if I'm looking straight forward, I'm looking into the sky. And my neck's fucking hurting. Whereas in reality, I just look up. I can look forward, and I can look up at that vault. I'm looking at it right now. And that is a difficult thing for the viewer right there. Because breaking my neck is, uh... It's not that nice. Let me tell you that. But I'll try. I'll try and remember that. Great. Now go inside and deactivate the power source. I'll do my best. Go inside and deactivate the power source. Wait, go inside where? Exactly. Um... Oh, this thing? Oh, this? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, hello! At least he's covering his private parts, man. Hey! In the dark. You're free now. It's okay. Your friend sent me. The Alex Vance. Hey. You are our friend. Yes. What are they doing to you here? What they do to us all. I told you it was Vortagon shit, man. The green stuff going through the cables. They're locking them up and using them to power the, the vault security. What's he doing? Okay, I'm trying to I'm trying to get the FOV right for you guys. It's really hurting my neck, but I'm trying. The combine drained from us the power they use to protect their weapon. There, there, there. Yeah, he's a power source. Ourselves. We have to stop them from killing your friends. The Vortigant will extract ourselves and exact our own vengeance. You must go to the weapon. Well, I can't get into the vault if the substations are still online. Do not worry. Dude, the cinematic experience here that I'm giving you guys. We will not allow it. I will clear the path. Thanks, buddy. Hey, there we go. That's where we're going. A path to bird. Okay. There is no Distance between us. 
Cheers, buddy. Thumbs up. Hey! Thanks. Great cam work. Good luck. Kappa? What do you mean, Kappa, dude? It was perfect from my point of view. Uh, okay, I'm going to try something as well, by the way. I'm going to give you guys um, higher spectam spectator camera smoothing. Let me know how this is, okay? We went from low to high on the smoothing. Thanks for breaking your neck for us, Fana. <laughs> no problem, man. Oh, God, ninjas here. I'm about to get trolled. I'll close that, press this, and off we go. A lot of trust in that Vortigon to shut down all the substations. Where am I in my room? I trust him. Yes, me too. Uh, because if he doesn't, well, that vault isn't going Okay, anywhere. let me know how the smoothing we'll is, guys. No vault to break into, surrounded by Should be a lot smoother now. Trusting him is our only plan here. I trust him. I this. like those guys, we man. We can do this. Yes, you're right. He'll be fine. We're all going to be fine. I'm gonna load everything up. Oh, we got shotgun shells now as well. This is much better. Oh, poggers. Four shells left. Is that maxed? I think so. Uh, I think I used that. Yeah, that's a piece of shit right there. Get rid of that. Um, okay, so um, we should be able to get ourselves out of this lift right here. I'll have to use my. Oh, there we go. Now, I'm assuming that... Oh, we're back in this area. They got me into... Twitchy camera's kind of annoying me. So, is that a thumbs up from most people in the chat on the smooth camera? Because, like, it, it, there's, a, there's a middle ground between... Oh! Fucking load the gun, man! Shit! Not this again, dude! Oh my god, get the fuck down! Get down! Get down on the ground! Everyone get on the ground right now! I need a new gun. Where's my pistol, dude? Oh! He's got a fucking shield! Shit, my ammo! My ammo! Oh, what do I do? Oh. Motherfucker. Mother... Oh, no. God damn it, guys. The ground wasn't safe. It wasn't safe. It wasn't safe. God, that hurt my knees. My goddamn knees, man. There's a hardwood floor in here, dude. It's like a real wall, god damn it. Send me back in, champ. Whew. God, this game's gonna kill me, man. All right. I'm ready this time. Everything's good, man. Everything's good. Fen Boomer! Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a hardwood floor, man. Okay. Uh, actually, load that thing. Load the machine Wait, gun. That's better. Uh, any grenades? No grenades. We're gonna get behind uh, this guy. Shit! Not these guys! I'm nearly dead already. Fuck's sake, man. Do I have a grenade? I got no grenade. Hey, 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 hey. God, I'm good, dude. I'm getting into the hang of this. Got him, got him, got him. Are we good? I'm kind of low. Let me load this bad boy up. Okay. 
Oh shit. Okay, around here maybe. Oh, 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 oh. It's like every freaking shot, man. I got like no health left. Let me get behind this. Load her up again. Love the trusty pistol. Love the trusty pistol, guys. Oh, 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 oh. fucking grenade! Oh no! My health! Motherfucker! Get away from the grenade. Woo! I need help. Yes! That was kind of satisfying, man. Woo! That felt good. I need some health. Badly. Um, can we go down here? No, that's where I came from earlier. Yeah, I got no health at all. Uh, we should load the weapon as well. Looks tough to move around. Always the difficulty with VR games is that it's going to be extremely tough to move around. Ugh. Feels fucking good, man. Get those drugs into me, dude. Again? Not again. Okay. Um. Oh, there we go. Yes. Uh, we got grenades. Taking that, put it into the arm. He's got one as well. Oh shit, my clip. Give me that clip. No, I can't put a clip into my arm. Back into the gun. Alright, good. Um, anything else around here? Okay. Boneworks has a free movement system. Like, walking around like this... Because, like, you can walk around like this, but, like, you're limited. I can only move within, like, three meters, right? You can't move through entire worlds. Uh, I prefer the shift version of moving around. Let me give it a go, Zeta. Let's see here. I don't know what this one is all about. Oh! No, I don't. I, it makes me feel sick. It makes me feel sick. I can't do that. So I'm really bad with motion sickness in VR for whatever reason, which I find kind of strange because I've never had like boat sickness or car sickness or anything like that. I've never experienced this kind of thing until I got VR. And then it's like any movement that I'm not doing myself, it just makes me sick. Instantly. Uh, I feel like that's gonna hurt. It's a mattress. We'll be fine. Other options: continuous movement. You start moving where your head is turned. But um, again, that makes me feel really sick. Oh, we got some boys. Hey. <laughs> oh shit! Close the door. They'll never find me in here, chat. There we go. Okay. Oh, dude, I've got a grenade. Hang on. Hey, 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 hey. I'm against the wall. I can't move. Fuck. This is a problem, man. I can't get the handle and also move my body. Fuck's sake. Okay. Shit. I need to get the grenade. I'm gonna push the door open and throw the grenade. I think we're good. I hear gr <gasps> How did that hit me? The door was fucking closed. Jeez, dude, I popped him fast. 
Anyone else? Getting kind of crowded down here, Russ. Com channel's gone crazy since we took out that substation. I know we're after the vault now. Whatever's in there, they really, really don't. I'm kind of lucky. I've got this wall right here, guys. If I didn't have this, I'd be walking into like, like if this was like a cupboard or something like this, something like that. I'd just be walking into a cupboard all the time. But thank God I've got a wall. So like, if I move backwards, I just end up leaning into this thing, which is great. Um, hello, resub. Uh, thank you very much. I really do appreciate the support, but I cannot see subs right now. That doesn't mean I hate you. In fact, I love you. Whoa, whoa, what is that? Okay, good, good, good. Bobby, thank you so much for the resub. And thank you for the orange tree. It's doing me well. I'm, pr I'm planting like entire rows of trees now. I'm stepping up my Animal Crossing game. Oh, I need this badly. Oh, a tier 3 poggers, dude. Clap it up in the chat for Bobby chat. Oh, another heal. Let's get it into me. There we go. Yeah, the guns do just fade out. Uh, we got a doorway over here. Have a look in the corner, see if there's any like hidden ammo or stuff like that, but it doesn't look like it. People clappers. Thank you very much, chat. You're the best. I'm so glad you got my back. Oh, trip mines. I know these things, dude. I've played Half-Life before. Did that hurt me? I think it did. Yeah, I got the Rift S. It's a dock, dude. Which I highly recommend, by the way, because you don't need, like, sensors in your room and stuff like that. And it's, oh, it's so much nicer. You can just put it on your head and you're good to go. All the other headsets, you have to put, like, sensors and, like, screw them into, like, the corner of the room and stuff like that. And it's a nightmare. Got him, dude. I think, like, you do need a PC for it, though. It basically goes like this. If you don't have a PC, um, get the Oculus Go. But I think you're very limited in the games that you can play. I don't think you can play Alex on the Oculus Go because it doesn't have enough power. But you can play stuff like Beat Saber and stuff, which is really cool. The Rift S is like your mid-tier option. What the f Oh, there was a mine in here. The Rift S is like your mid-tier option. And you don't need sensors for it, which is friggin' awesome. The downsides are... Oh, shit. You need a computer. Um, that's kind of powerful. And the sensor system isn't as good as, like, actually having stuff in your corner. But I haven't had a problem with it personally. But the lighting in my room is also really good. Oh, there's one of these fly boys. Come on. And then there's the index, which I think has 120 hertz refresh rate, which is really good for motion sickness and stuff. But you need stuff in the corners. It also has individual finger detection. Um. Jesus Christ! I can't get it, man. Um. Okay, I need to be able to get this guy. Hang on. Don't know where I am in my room. Oh. Another one? I'm really low on health. I don't think I can win this fight. But we can damn well try, dude. I'm gonna whip out the shotgun and blast this thing as it comes in. Okay, just gonna wait. There we go. Okay. 
Yeah, Bobby Kapuk and H-Bob bought me this thing for Christmas, which is extremely generous of them. We would not be playing. Ah, oh, not again! I gotta get out there and kill these guys, but I got one HP and I'm so scared. Got it. Okay, okay, we gotta do this fast. Reload. Fuck's sake. No! Alex. Damn. Yeah, I took too much damage from the flying dudes. Gotta go a lot faster here, so I don't keep throwing up flying dudes. Yeah, Valve Index is top tier, but it's it's very expensive. Like, you're really committing to VR if you get the Valve Index. It's like $1,200, I think. Whereas the Rift S was 450 Which I think is pretty reasonable. Considering, you know, it works pretty damn well. Basically, going from the Rift S to the Index, you're getting full finger tracking. Which, I don't think there's really any games that make use of that yet. So, like, you're... Ah, ha, ha. You can't have future proofing there. Uh, you get a higher hertz display and you get better audio. And I think a higher resolution. Oh, dude, there's an explosive barrel. Why is it not blowing up? Hey, hey. The aim's on point, boys. Shit. I got just a little bit of life. Let's clap this guy real quick. I can't get the aim on him, dude. Alex. Oh. Alex, you still there? All right, all right, go again. It was like, uh, the aim was like stuck on the wall there. Stuck on the goddamn wall, man. Uh, how fun would we play? Yeah, so if you get the Valve Index, which costs about almost $1,000 more, you can flip people off in-game. So that's, that's obviously a big advantage. You know, if that's worth $1,000 to you, then go for it. Okay, so this blows up as I open it. What can I do about that? Um, oh, it's there! Look at that! No, this is zero auto-aiming. You gotta do all of this yourself. It's very realistic aiming for, for like, a, a game with so many, like, um, silly mechanics. I, I don't want to say silly, but, like, it's very fictional, you know? They could have gone with some kind of auto-aiming system. And it probably would have been a lot more comfortable to play it like that. Try and take him out fast. We got him, dude. Poggers. Index doesn't suck from the screen door effect. Like, kind of seeing like a black line in the middle. Have you ever done airsoft or paintball? No, Ninja, but I really want to do it, man. Yo, if I ever come come to Australia, Ninja, we, you, do you want to go? I would love to fucking shoot you, Ninja. Honestly. That'd be a dream come true, man. <laughs> With pain. Of, pain. What's that sound? Russ, are they saying my name? Yeah, that's not good. Are they baiting me? I'm being debated by the bad dudes. You see the... Oh, yeah, yeah, you can see the individual pixels. But it, it's hard to explain. It's not a bad thing. You can notice them if you really pay attention. Um, you see, like, these... 
I guess like black lines between the pixels, but like if you if you explain it as black lines between the pixels, I feel like people are imagining like big, thick, black lines. Whereas like it's very minimal. You can barely notice it. Don't take that out of context. Although that may have been the intention. For funny yoke purposes. Sure, we'll take that. Get semi drunk first, then painful. Paintball? You want me to throw up on the paintball field? Sounds terrible. Live parasitics. Oh no! Oh, he's out of the. He's out of the. If I'm running around drunk, yeah, man. I don't think I... Honestly, I'm gonna be honest. I don't think I've ever... Fuck, I need bullets! Oh, he's, he's good. He's good. He's busy with something else. What are you busy with? Um... Hey, Barrel. How's it going, Alex? Yeah, you can barely notice it. Um... Get him, headcrab. Get him. Three more. I don't think I've ever run around while I'm drunk. It's just not like something I'm thinking of when I'm drunk, you know? It's like, hey, let's go for a run. I'm fucking drunk, boys. When I'm drunk, I'm like, I'm in bed crying. No, I mean, uh, you know, I'm just having a good time sitting around, mostly. Um... Let's see, is that heels? I need those heels, man. Oh, the shotgun bullets. Shells, dude, shells. Ever rode a bike when half run? Half drunk, you mean? No. Again, uh... You know, the first thing that comes to mind when I'm drunk is not athletic endeavors. I'm so low on HP right now. <gasps> oh, that could have killed me. It looks like you can delete these things with the magic wands, actually. Let's give that a go. Careful. Oh my god, careful. Jesus Christ, this is delicate work, man. Oh boy. Is it not in? Oh, you gotta go through those things. It's like playing pilot wings, man. Yes! Will you ever play Hearthstone? Um, Madsen, if you go check my YouTube channel right now, I actually put up two Hearthstone uploads. Um, hey. Not too long ago. So the answer is yes. Alex? Alex! God damn it. I don't even know where that was. <laughs> Fucking Keck W, dude. The answer is yes. However, I'm playing so many games right now. Hearthstone is like... At the bottom of the priority list. So for me right now, it's like... Single player game per week. This is what's kind of in my mind, okay? Single player game per week. Then... Now, I gotta get some Overwatch in. You know, we always gotta get some Overwatch in. I also wanna play Warzone, dude. It's been so long since I've actually played Warzone. Gotta get that done. And then after Warzone... Then it's Hearthstone. Okay, where's this mine? This and Doom is so fun. Glad you're liking it, man. Oh, there it is. Can I get my wand on that? 
Dude, if I just had long spaghetti arms, man. Oh, fucking hell. I'm gonna push the door. Oh, come on, dude. I need a longer arm. What's going on? Come on. I can't get it. I, Dude, I need... Come on. No! Alex? Alex? Oh. If my arm was like three centimeters longer, I'd be good. I'm telling you, man, this game's a lot easier if you're six foot tall with long spaghetti arms. Like, imagine if you were shorter than me with tiny arms like this. Right? You were like this. And you were trying to get that mine. You'd be like, oh, no! No, I, 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 I can't get it! Ugh. But it'd be even worse, man. Alright, let's try this again. Yeah, I can throw stuff through the laser beam. I was just trying to do it like that to save resources, you know? We're a master. I'm a professional. I'm 5'3". What's that in centimeters? I mean, I assume arm length directly correlates to your height. Um, but I'm also sure there's people... Uh, maybe we can... Uh, we'll throw this can, maybe. No. Oh, that did knock the door a bit. But I'm sure there's also, like, abnormalities there, you know? Like, you can be kind of short, but also have really long arms. That was a fucking disaster. Come on. <laughs> this is not gonna work. Uh, grenade, maybe? Okay, we're gonna roll it in nice and easy. Shit! You know what? It did the job. Oh, you kidding me? You could have opened the door the other way. Why did no one think about that? <laughs> I didn't see anyone suggest that, so I'm gonna say it's not only me who didn't think of that. Next time, though. I'll open the door the other way. Hey, take it. God damn! Oh, oh, it's Eli, man. Honestly, I'd peg your survival at about four percent. You can take that four to come. Little crying right now, good. <laughs> Russell, Russell, put Dad on. Abby, baby. Dad. All right, let's listen to we Dad. Just took down a substation. Good, because when they move this thing, that weapon's gone. We need to get it tonight. We will. You Where am I right now? Lot, right? I do. I Russell, feel like I'm walking into I'll things in real life. I'm gonna need the TLR. Where the yep, fuck am I, chat? There. Okay, great. Wall. You That's a wall. For sure. You go ahead. I'll be fine, Dad. There's my carpet. Promise. Keep that promise. I'll get to work on the data pod. Shit, wrong copy. Yo, Redden is desperate for some fucking weed, man. Any mines in here? Oh, what's down here? Oh, that, oh, ugh. Don't like that. Oh, Animal Crossing weed. Dude, that's a mannequin, not a dude. That's one thirsty head crab right there, man. What's going on with this thing? Nothing. Can't get any human action, so it's turned straight to the plastic mannequin, dude. Okay, I guess we're going down here. Am I gonna break my legs? 
Oh, it's a loading screen. I thought I died. 